If you want to become a full-time photographer, this course will take you step by step right through everything that you need to know to setting up as a photographer. We help you to start part-time first, just on the weekends, and then convert over to a full-time photographer. It's a fantastic trade to be in. Have a look what's in the course. Because I do a lot of location shooting, going to parks, etc., to do fashion shots or lovely family shots or portraits, I found it's better to build your own and put it in and that's exactly what I've got behind me. Come and have a look. Lean through and hug the other members of the family. Now what does that do? It puts all their heads on the same plane. So when I uh, zoom my lens in a little bit to put the background nicely out of focus, all their heads are in focus because they're all on the same plane. But uh, if you can afford to start with two of them, probably under $500 each. Here they can see a clear indication of the type of work that you're capable of. Gold will give too much of a gold complexion. Silver's cutting it down to half, so we're getting half gold, half silver. So if we see here, we can see the lights in her eyes, so I can see and tell that this has been done in a studio, because I can even see the, the photographer. You might go for an hourly price of $100 an hour, but if there's three hours work or more. Photography, formal photography, graduation <laughs> photography, and center wow. photography, so. So you're really busy. We have to put aside that we're photographers and now pick up the business hat that we're actually marketing, and we're marketing your business. People don't know that we're charging $100 an hour or $150 an hour. They'd probably have a heart attack if you told them, because they're thinking, I work for $40 an hour, Why why should you get $150 an hour? No, it's a package. Look at registering your business. Well, maybe you need an ABN number or GST registration. In our body copy, what we're writing there is from our hypnotic sales language that we've already talked about. So we put that in with a word starting like, imagine having the best family photos, blah, blah, blah. Now, daylight bulbs aren't that expensive, so you can actually set up a corner in your room with some proper daylight bulbs. Beautiful stock photography, I would definitely use prime lenses because they're a lot cheaper to buy than a really good zoom lens that won't give you that sort of problem. And it makes it beautiful. So grab one of these and keep it with you always. One of the most frightening things that can happen to a photographer is that you do a wedding uh, or, a, or a shoot for fashion, etc., or a portrait shoot, the person's gone, you've got your card out, you've accidentally erased it down to tone, Again, that should be at standard. Imagine a model standing right next to this wearing a white dress. She's going to get some of this come off onto a white dress. So it's important that we put a bit of white paper nearby so it's getting some of the red, takes the photo without that mirror bouncing up. It's the bouncing up and down of the mirror that actually ripples the water. Fixation button, I push that and I can plus the exposure if I find my photographs are just a little bit dark or if I can go the other way, I can minus them if they're blowing out just a little bit. So shrink wrap uh, and the customer can see it quite easily and it makes for good travelling and everyone's happy happens is it simply sits on the front of your screen like that and it actually reads the picture underneath. Now the picture is on this disc. I can't talk highly enough about it. it. It puts the colours back to where they should be so all your colour balances are correct. How do I know that this is a good camera over another camera that's exactly the same model? In cars you can, people say, oh you bought a lemon but mine's a good one. And that, that can be from the manufacturing faults. Same model, everything the same, but one's great and one's a lemon. This is what I do. If you want to become a full-time photographer, why not enroll in one of our digital photography business courses?